What's up everybody, this is Eric with Trout's Fly Fishing in Denver. Uh, in this installment of Getting Started in Fly Tying, we are going to talk about how to dress a hook. So a couple things to kind of understand about this um, getting started with it is uh, first of all, you always want your thread spinning away from you. So if you're looking at your thread or you're looking at your hook um, at the, the point of the eye of the hook, um, it, you're turning it clockwise basically. Um, so I'm going to hold, hold the thread in the bobbin. Basically all I want to do is I want my thread hand below, my bobbin hand above. And when I make those turns, I want to do a couple, two or three turns going towards the eye of the hook. And then I want to start making turns where I'm going back over those. And then once I get a few turns there, I'm going to hold the thread even with the hook shank. So now I can do side by side turns and I'm basically pinning that tag end of the thread to the hook shank. And now my thread is attached. It, it can't come undone or spin off. So now I have my thread attached to the hook and I can begin tying. Typically on most patterns, when you dress the hook, you're essentially putting a layer of thread down on the entire hook shank. And it's not critical to cover every little last bit of the hook, um, but you want that thread base down so that your materials have something to grip to. Um, hooks are very smooth. If you don't, um, they wanna slide around. So we dress the hook so that our materials can grab and always take and clip off our tag end. And now hook stressed, we're ready to start tying. Um, stay tuned for more tying videos and tips on, on techniques. Um, check out our YouTube channel. Have a good day.